Hey everybody, this is Ryan from Linked University. Today we're going to talk about how to accept a connection request on LinkedIn. Obviously LinkedIn is a really powerful tool for networking, um, business prospecting, looking for a job, but it becomes significantly less powerful if you don't know how to use it, if you don't know how to connect with people, how to participate in groups. So without building your network of connections, you know, LinkedIn is significantly less powerful for you. So if you do have somebody send you a connection request, I always suggest, I always, you know, offer the advice of connect with everyone. It's never going to hurt you. The, the, the only thing is now you can, um, you, you know, you can message their connections. You can uh, send connection requests to, to know their connections. So you're essentially you're building your secondary connection database, which is a good thing. So if someone sends you a connection re request on LinkedIn, I would always suggest accept it. And if it becomes a problem, if they're spamming you, then at that point you can go in. You can, um, you know, unconnect with them. So today... To accept a connection request, you want to go up to this little envelope up top and click it. This is also your message inbox. So when we get in here, we're going to have my connection invitations and my messages. I don't know, not quite, quite sure why it's not showing that I have any invitations, but I know I do. So when you get in here, it's going to originally bring you to your messages. So click the invitations tab, and it says that Rod Miller and Jeff Haney want to connect with me. And like I said, I always suggest connect with everyone. The bigger your network is, the more um, prospects and the more, you know, potential clients, potential, you know, networking partners that you can reach. So to do this, all you have to do is just click accept. And it's going to go ahead and automatically say, you know, Rod is now my connection. And now Jeff is now my connection. And now I could go through and I could message them. I would also suggest... Um, you know, at some point, you don't have to do this every time you get something, maybe once a month or twice a month, find all your new connections and send a bunch of them a connection, uh, a message saying, hey, thanks for connecting with me. I look forward and staying in touch. So when you do message them down the road, it doesn't quite come out of nowhere. For more tips and tricks on how you can build your business on LinkedIn, check out linkeduniversity.com and remember to subscribe to the Linked University YouTube channel for more LinkedIn basics.